life look like if you had no fears? If you weren't afraid to try new things, what would you do? Let's go find out what people have to say about this topic. What does tangible reality mean to you? Um, it just means real. <laughs> anything we can touch, anything we can smell, anything we can actually feel with our senses. Something that I can touch, like physically, and something I can interact as well in my own life. I think it's something that you make. I don't even know what tangible reality even means, so, like, can we go to the next question? Do you think that you can intentionally create your own life? Or do you feel that life just happens to you? Uh, no. It is what you make of it. I think it's a combination of both. I think some of it just happens to you. You can't change circumstances sometimes. But I do think there's a you have a lot of control over how you react and how you move forward with what you do have. You're totally the only creator of your life. Things happen to you, but you create what happens after those things and what happens as a result of those things. Um, I think you have a choice over what happens in your life, so I think you can choose your own kind of path on how it goes. You're not a slave to random events. You can control where you go. You could choose to act or be acted upon. And when you choose to act, you're choosing to create your own reality. You're making your dreams happen. Do you think that your thoughts are powerful? And how has your thoughts affected your life and where you want to be? Yeah, uh, thoughts are really powerful. Oh, hands down. I mean, what come, what is up here affects what you say and what you do. Whatever's in there tends to happen out here. Everything that you do starts as a thought. I don't know. That's where it starts. I feel like that's the first step, your thoughts. Everything that I, I think and I believe drives my own decisions especially like my own like personal beliefs, like my way of living my life, those different thoughts will choose you know, how I live pretty much. The thoughts that you have control who you are because actions really make you. So I mean, tracing it back, uh, thought leads to action and action leads to you know, what you do and who you are. It feels like a, like a war in my mind every day and then between like negative and positive thoughts. Oh, your thoughts are everything. Every battle, I guess, that you lose or win, is lost or won before the battle ever starts. If you never had fear, you never catastrophize, you never played out the worst case scenario, would your life be different? What risks would you take tomorrow that maybe you haven't taken today? I would go skydiving. I think I'd take more risks. I'm not sure, I think I just have more courage and day-to-day -day decisions, whether that be school, work, relationships, whatever it may be. Oh, I would absolutely take more risks. I feel like I overthink things way, way too much, um, and that stops me from doing a lot of things because I'm afraid of, of messing up or failing or not accomplishing something. My life would be totally and completely different. I'm, I mean, I don't, I don't even, I don't even know what it would look like because I mean, there's there's lots of different things that I that I see other people doing and I think would be fun, but I don't know. I just I don't have the the courage to get out there and try them myself. Each and every person in the world has a dream. With that dream comes along fear. Ogmandino said it best: "What is success other than a state of mind?" And I add, "What is failure?" other than a state of mind. Today we went out, we talked to people. What is your biggest fear? If you had no fear, what would you do? What, can you create your dreams in tangible reality and do thoughts impact your life? Why are we as individuals so afraid to go after what we truly want in life? Why are we afraid to take risks? What is stopping us from taking the next step? Why are we so afraid to commit to them? Why are we so afraid to dream dreams?